Hello everyone, this is Don. I am in Kingdom 410 on a farm over here. Uh, what we're going to do today is a very long overdue video. And I do remember just about everybody who asked me to do a Spirit Minds video a long, long time ago. And it was always next week's, next week's, next week. And I just was the ant that can't on that one, guys. I'm sorry. Uh... But I was looking through stats today, and it is still one of the most requested videos out there. So we're going to tackle that topic. Give me a second. For those that are new to my channel because they're coming in here, because you're probably a new player if you're looking this up, because the goal here is how to get uh, into and, and what, what to be doing in the spirit minds. Because you hear people talking about it, and you, want, you, you feel a little dumb trying to ask an alliance chat or kingdom chat. Or, quite frankly, if you've watched any of my other videos on 410, they will do everything they can to belittle you for not knowing it already before you went to there. That's how helpful that community uh, feature tends to be. I've never seen so much trash talk. So, that's how I get traffic driven to me, because they don't help in game. We have to help out a game. And I do appreciate it when you guys watch. And thumbs up, and like, and subscribe, all that good stuff. Okay, so... First, let's talk about, this is a Spirit Minds, okay? Now, I've got this farm already in here, farming on level 2. You see, i got four hours left. Nice thing about level 2 is you can reset it. If you're on any level above 2, you have to get kicked off. And let me tell you the dirty little secret. This is an old, old, old system. Everybody in the game is still in here. There is no limit to the number of uh, spawns on level 2. Okay? So, the that's where you're going to wind up being. Just get that in your head until they patch this thing. I hear rumors of a one-hour time limit, which is going to mean that people that can't be on the game 24-7 uh, or, or great big monster castles can't sit there and camp the high spots so that you're actually fighting for the high spots because honestly three hours up at, at the high levels is equal to 24 hours at any low level so if you if you got the ability to fight against people that are in your class your weight class and hold the node for any time during the day it's another portion of the game where there was supposed to be a combat aspect to it with no loss to troops that got left behind and in the dirt okay it has become just a place to build your your account for free that's all it's become uh it's a chore the uh so we're going to talk about the we're going to talk about it in that aspect of the chore and when the changes finally do come i will post a video about the changes that have come all right so two reasons to be working on this one if it's your main account you need to be pulling stuff out of spirit minds every day now i just told you this is a farm account Look at this, 12 million power, very little power here. I'm a level 23 on a C16 castle. Okay, so why do I got VIP 8 on? Because I went into the spirit mines and I bought VIP 8. <laughs> kept buying it, kept buying it, kept buying it, so I get VIP 8. Why did I do that? So that I can have five March slots. That allows me to gather 20% faster than with four March slots. Okay, that allows me to be gathering in the, in the Alliance mine. Uh, earning my uh, alliance celebration points. When you gather in the alliance, whatever it is, food, wood, silver, iron, whatever it is, you get celebration points. And these are important. I got like eight people in here, and we're almost done for the week. We're not going to finish this week. I mean, we, we can't get that last box because we got eight people. But any alliance of any respect should have these things done on Tuesday. Okay? Uh, and if they keep selecting gory banners every single stinking week, they just are selecting gory banners because they want to stockpile them for way, way, way down the road. Uh, it is not good for alliance growth to be doing that. You should be really early on doing aristocrat badges because they are... Hero store food. We go over here, we click, we click special. I already spent mine. We don't sell our banners for the very reason they want to click banners every week. They are hard to get later down the road. 
you stockpile those bad boys. I don't care if it says you got 60,000 of them. It ain't enough. So. Buying, ba buying banners from the spirit mines is one of the chores that you will wind up doing at some point. You're down here. Okay. So. There's two levels you've got to reach in the spirit mines. In order. You see right here where I got stuff that's locked up? Well, this is a farm. I want it to be able to buy silver every day. So I've got to clear floor 10. That means that on my farm, I can no longer ignore putting gear and gems on it if I want it to be a productive farm. And there's a thing out there called uh, Goodnight Bots. That goes out there and it grabs farming modes, and you see these guys, they, they you know, the 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 overseas guys that tend to have like 50 of these C10 castles that are all out there gathering all the time. That's that, but I can also tell you, not productive, not even practical if you don't own industrial servers. I own industrial servers, and I I do use the bots to do certain daily things. But I don't ever stick them in my main alliance. That's not what the point is. It's not to make them grow. Uh, the uh, the There's just certain daily things that we need to get done so that we can do this, which is shoot you a video, right? And I'm not going to sit here and build up a C16 account that I don't need just to do that. But the point winds up being is we want to get to this point, all right, where we can open up the bags. And there's a million iron there. There's more, you know, there's, there's a few million there. There's more millions there, right? And this is C16, so there's all that silver, stuff like that. And guess what, guys? It's bagged, which means it cannot be stolen. They can burn every troop out of your village every time. Be the smart ass they want to be. You're safe. They will go to K Kingdom Chat and talk about this garbage up here. Who cares? You cannot gather enough in 24 hours for what you get out of these areas here. All right, so while I got this open. So, for our farms, we want to be on Cata 8. So, I, I, this little C16 castle is down here on Cata 8. And I can buy the big packs, right? This is a lot of stuff. Uh, it's quarter million in silver a day. It's another 1.3, 1.6, I can't remember, totals. In uh see if I can numb my throat up here. My gosh. Uh, the, uh, it's, it's another 1.3, 1.6. But you add to that the million that you're getting in, in iron from the spirit mine every day. Plus another quarter million, uh, not a quarter million, uh, it's 25 times uh, 10. Yeah, it is quarter million. Uh, the, uh, that you can get in silver per day. And C30 is easy. Okay? C30 is free. Honestly, you will outgather your timers. Okay? That, oh, I got to stop saying, okay, I'm so, I apologize for that. That's ignorant. And it's for the, uh, anywho. So, what do we need to do to get past that? Well, there's certain little tips and tricks that we do. Okay, so I told you while I was in there, but then I didn't do it while I was in there, did I? All right. Accolades. See, I bought all four of them already. I'm wearing them. They're going to increase my damage. Now, we're going to set up our airship. Now, this is one of these things. Now, I probably don't have any cards that are of benefit, but you should look in you. Uh, change. She would be the card you'd put on for doing stuff like this, but she only helps with the uh, uh, guardian at the early level. So when, if you're doing this, you're at an early level. Uh, so while I'm here, guards, your entire account needs to be set up to do this is what I'm getting at. So you need to go in here. Get your guard matchings and your other stuff going. Get what you got. All right. So you see it's a farm, and I'm turning around and leveling all my green cards, something I've told you to do in other videos. You level all those first so that the uh, 
other cards drop easier. You start getting them in bigger bulks, bigger gulps. Uh, well, we just got her. She's not good for what I'm doing, but she'll have to do. And we do have D'Artagnan, which will give me a cap boost. All right. Now, I match those three guards. I just got a 25,000 March cap on player versus environment, PVE. This is not player versus player where I'm attacking another castle. This is player versus environment. March cap is does still seem to be the largest stat. Now, that will be important for doing expeditions on Tuesday for the air, airship expedition and the spirit mine thing that we're going to do. right now so now the only tab we have to worry about for, for airship is this front tab okay so I heard it the so you see that I have a limitation here and we are going to go in what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna engage because we're going to have a limit. Oh, don't do that again. Right? And that's not enough to engage. I got to go to 20 to engage that purple. Greens. We'll show you there. Okay, so. Blues go to 15. And greens go to 10. So as you might get. I'm going to probably turn around and at least make that green one 10. And I can tell you that while it rolls other stats, uh, the defense stats are not as important as the health and attack on this event. Uh, doesn't really matter all that much, just to be fair. So... I'm going to go to my big stat. Now, guys, anytime we're setting up our airship, distance versus infantry damage, okay? You're going to hear me say the word damage is king. Look at that. I'm already out of parts. So, luckily, I did a little bit of prep. And I'm going to go buy another pack of parts here real quick. Oops. Plus, I had some in there already. Now, what you do on your talent points will matter. Uh, but not enough to... We're really going to play with the March cap here to get you past level 10 is what we're going to do. All right, so... I got that one past 10, which means I'm engaging some... I'm not going to engage the defense. Oh, I'm sorry. Wrong thing. I'm not going to engage my distance. Distance matters. Distance is the most important. That's why it's last on this list, if you want to know. Uh, distance is your most, most important troop. So, let's go back here. And, as you see, I have him on my troop. That's why he's in the middle. When you see people starring up their airship, if they have five stars on their march cap and four stars on their distance versus infantry, their airship is set up wrong. Only time you'd use that fifth star on the thing is if you're doing player versus environment. That's the only time you do it. Otherwise, the March of Fury is the last thing you star up. Uh... You swap them around as you need them for doing things inside your account. But nobody on the outside should ever see that mistake because you should be swapping them back. Okay, so let's go down here to other stuff. This is another important one. So we're going to go to 10s.
I do have it on there, don't I? All right, so I can start going bigger here in a minute. But the other one we're going to do over here. We're going to max this guy out. Why? Because I can turn around and move him around. Okay, so he's on my attack. Remember, attack's important. He's going to make sure my distance attack is locked, locked open. This one's making sure my other distance attack's locked open. So... Those are the two stats that I was looking for to get this done. All right, so I got to my base tens, and now I can go stack some other stuff up in here. Uh, it's not going to engage my, my next tier. That one did. Okay. Oh, oh man. I should have. I might be able to get both if I'm just, just. This is why you don't rush ahead. Do what you need to do. Go back in there. You don't want to pay to reset it. That just cost me 200 gold because I, I clicked real quick. So that's actually maxed to what I can get on my attack airship right now. Okay. I can't do any better. Uh, well, that's not true. I can go look at my at my other stuff. So specials. I don't have any gears. <coughs> and I don't have any ability to buy any either. So uh, that's not going to happen. All right. Now. Your armory. Now, I deliberately waited on this one. Uh. It is stupid easy to get Duelist now. In fact, I will tell you that Duelist 5 is probably achievable within three weeks of starting a new account for free at this point. Just play around the shooting. Not free. You got to have the shooting gallery open. Pay attention to the $5 daily deal pack and boom, your Duelist plus 5 pretty easily. So... I got my threes here, and we are now playing with uh, the boost, okay? So I'm going to go to three, and we're doing this in steps. We don't just run one up to five, because one at five and the other's at one is not better gear all of them at one is good is better gear than having one at five and everything else is zero and the next step is all of them at three so we're going to go three and i need you to watch right up here on the screen where i'm circling right now set resonance booth removed 50 percent added 120 what did that just do that took the top three lines it's very important lines and they were now plus 50% and they are now plus 120%. That's where that number comes from on your gear. And we'll show you here just shortly. So I've got, there's some other cheats here if you're really behind. And I don't think I need them, but we're going to use them anyway. Uh, we're going to use the horn. Equip. Uh, I'm going to respec. Oops, not what I want to do. What I'm looking for here, March Cap. As I told you, that's important here. Uh, distance being our important factor here, so I'm going to go chase that line. But that's the number I was looking for. Then I'm going to go Calvary, which is our second most important. And look at that talent, Colossal March. That's going to be big. Okay. So, uh, <coughs> I 
All right. I'm really sorry about this coffin. Your coat of arms will matter. Do what you can there. Banners on your building. Always important. Will be important forever. Okay. Uh, Got to make sure your banner, building is bannered up. The other thing you can do is estate buffs. All right. And there's our attack one. I'm not going to blow gold for that. 20% will be enough. But our March cap. These eight hours, if you're wondering where they're at, you buy those in the Spirit Mines, actually. All right. So if I go down here and look, I only got 3,000 troops. But I now have 106,000 March cap, and it's about to get much bigger. So what I'm going to do is we're going to run the spirit mines. Oh. Now, whatever you enter the spirit mines with stays with you until you do a complete reset where you start back down to floor zero. Okay, so me activating this colossal march, having all these uh, march and having all these boosts boosts on there. Uh I'm going to select no because I don't want my previous benefits. If I just clicked yes, I'd have been back down to that 60K March cap. Now I'm at 110,000 March cap. Okay. And with that March cap, we're just going to go in there. And you see my two, my 300 top lines? That's because 120 of it's that gear that I just did. So I added 120 of that gear. Uh that's enough to get me down to 10 it really is now I like to be a little bit strong now this is the part that confuses people what do I do with all these buffs okay this is where they threw you into the deep end but didn't tell you what any of this stuff means okay so first thing I usually pick is infantry damage received minus four now these buffs will get bigger with each level but the reward you get also gets not big enough to buy more and more every time. So I skipped the first one to build up a stack up here in the upper left so that I have some to, some to buy. And I just buy those damage received ones down there at the bottom because damage, damage reduction is powerful. Uh... But troop stats are more power are, are as powerful. And see, I'm watching this number up here. I don't want that to fall below 80. I honestly don't want it to fall sharply. So let's I need to start paying attention. No sharp fall there. So I can go buy more benefits. And I want to buy some more troop attack. Now we're at level 5, so it's going to get a little bit harder. See, I lost 3%. Not enough to concern myself with. And I'll show you why. And just it, It'll take a couple floors. Now I'm going to increase my distance damage now because I'm probably going to have to start rehealing my mobs. I, I try to save my distance damage stat for the last one that I know I'm going to be able to buy before I have to start clicking this restore march cap to 20%. Now, I'm not going to have to. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get to buy something else. Uh, but I don't have enough. So, oddly enough, I don't get to buy something else. And now we're down to 91. I'm going to have to restore that march. Okay, so I've done this a lot of times. Honestly, it's hard to remember why you do what you do. You get in such repetitive motion. So I'm going to restore my march. I'm going to have it back to 100%. And that's pretty much what all I'm going to do until I get down to floor 10. All right. Now, I didn't win. So we will look in here. And there's lots of places where I can improve my account. Let's see if I go to redeem. I think actually, yeah. See, I unlocked that loot. Where it says mining area level 9, this is floor 10. All you have to do is reach it. 
So I have unlocked it. I didn't get by it. So if I was wanting to be Uber and fight on the upper levels, so now that you've reached here, what do you do? You go in here and fight. No, guys, don't. It, it was If it was hard for you to get past floor four or five, uh, guys, they, the, the, the big monster predators of the game have just filled these things. I mean, there's, there's not enough room for the number of players. This is an outdated, outdated, outdated system. We're just trying to show you how to survive in the system and get what you need out of it. All right, so. The, uh, now we will reset the mines. Confirm. Enter the mine shaft. Yes. Oh, I didn't want to do that. See, I went right back to level nine. Not what I wanted to do. Don't be clicking in arbitrary. So reset mines, confirm. Good demonstration of why why pay attention to my pay attention yourselves. Click no. Okay. That'll put you back down on floor one. And then at this point, it doesn't matter if you pick anything or not. You know you can get to floor two. Level mining area two. I'm gonna go in. Yes. I'm going to spend the rest of my life there until they patch this, this area. All right. What are you going to buy from this thing? If you're in there twice a day, all right, you can buy all kinds of goodies. First thing I recommend you do, get the VIP points to eight. You will enjoy a benefit in catacombs. You will also, don't and don't spend your gold. Uh, guys, if you will use the spirit mines to get to VIP eight, get your opening gold that you get that'll put fifteen hundred into this account right here and do this every day. You have permanent VIP status for free. Okay, every every you'll you'll have your four thousand gold every month for free. There's not a farm I have that I spend any money to keep my VIP status on. It's all free because I spent that first initial few dollar investment. All right. So if you want to be a free player, you can't play this game without opening up the shooting gallery. So let's look at that really quick because if I'd have needed to uh, boost my stats, which I do, of course, right? So let's reset the targets. I'm going to go up here. I'm going to select gemstones. Hit refresh. Of all the dumb luck, what I wanted landed right there on the first screen. Okay. And this is from experience seeing it all the time. But see these 300 justice stones? I know I can get that 300 scripts by shot five. So I'm going to start. There was shot four. Guess what that means on my little farm account guy. You guys just watched me do it. I'm going to go to my gemstone armory. And look, I don't have any of those. I'm going to activate. I'm going to craft. I'm on bed. Could have used those few minutes to go down there in the spirit mines, couldn't I? Yeah, so this is just showing you what, you know, when you fail, this is how you fix what you fail. And see, I can go down here. And because I got 300 of them, activate. I can craft, embed. And I am get more. I don't want to do that. Wait a second. Quick select this man. Okay. So I'm waiting. Oh, I could upgrade it if I wanted to. 
but not my forward. And I've gained 2 million power since the start of this film. Okay, and it, this is... But more importantly... Oh, I went and blew them all real quick. But now I can go down here at the end of this next reset and I can buy all five of these silver packs. All five of these silver packs. And I can do that. Basically, you can get all ten of those out in a day. So this becomes a twice a day chore. If this is a farm, you're wanting RSS out of it. If it's your main, get your VIP level up. Uh, and then start buying airship for the rest of your life guys just i mean absolutely go nuts on airship if your alliance is sucking so bad it can't get through the uh to get you the banners that it needs you're gonna have to buy banners but i promise you it's smarter to go to some place where if you're wanting to grow <laughs> go to some place that can grow but you've got to do your job before you complain about other people's not doing theirs and that is donations and you see we're over here, we're donating for battle strategies. Yeah. Because when I got people that want to fart around during KE next month, I'm going to poison water their entire alliance, and it's going to be the most expensive KE they ever had. Just saying. There's a reason for the madness here, folks. All right. But this has been Don Kingdom 5. 410 is what I'm on now today. And I hope you guys learned what you needed to glean from this. I went as fast as I could to kind of keep this short and sweet. Uh, but all the little hiccups of how to get the little things in there. Things you could have skipped were the horn. Uh, stuff like that. And since you're going to have to be shooting for gems anyway, should have done that first. Could have made the account more powerful before it went down there. Uh, but yeah... There's all the all the little steps that you need to do that kind of stuff. The uh, so I appreciate it all, and uh, down in the bottom right hand corner is a subscribe button. That's the best love you can give me. I promise you. And then the other thing is, tell the other people in your alliance, hey, are you not getting a million iron a day out of the spirit mines? Gumuse has showed me how to do it. That guy is awesome. Or he's a dick, but I'll listen to him anyway. I don't care. Hey, I appreciate it, guys. Thank you.